Some students asked me about adding video to PowerPoint when they moved their file somewhere else that uh, the video wouldn't play. Probably that's because of the way PowerPoint handles video. So let's just imagine we're going to put a video on this page. They have a, a nice feature which is adding arbitrary things to pages. So let's insert a movie and uh, here we can do this one. You probably want something you've compressed and not just a a raw video that off a DVD for example um, and you have the choice of when it's clicked or starting automatically usually when clicked is a good choice because then you have a little control and then uh, so here's some tips keep your movie small learn about compressing video you can learn a lot of that on the internet um, and it depends of course whether you have a Mac or Windows but there's lots of utilities out there Keep it in the same folder as your PowerPoint file. So once you save this, um, and I'll save this one in that same folder. So you can see the uh, bigbrother.mov is there. So I'll call it Big Brother. Uh, oops, Big Brother. .ppt. Um, so that now, if you ever want to move that you can go and take both of those files and move them wherever you need to move them. Um, and in fact, it's not a bad idea to create a, a folder and put all that stuff in there. Uh, move that. Or so if you're putting on a USB drive or whatever to move it somewhere, always cre keep all those things together. And so keep them all together. And the result should be that when you're playing it, so let's just play our movie here. Uh, oops, <laughs> it's got it in the uh, preview mode here. Let's not do that. Slideshow. Uh, no, I don't want to do that. Setup show, here we go. Show presenter tools. There we go. All right, let's try again. Slideshow. All right, so there's my movie. It plays. Hello. Are you going to play? A picture has there always been worth a thousand words. And uh, there's my tips. So the trick really is keeping them together. There is an option in the save as to create a um, PowerPoint package and that will put I think bundle them all together so let's just try that big brother and then I'll oops there it is so we'll just look at that in the finder see it's actually made the folder and there's the pptx and there's the mov file so it actually does that for you so that may be uh, just a quick way of doing that rather than doing it by hand is so it, here it is save as and a powerpoint package and that makes sure you have all the things together all right good luck with your shows